Welcome back. Joining us now is John Cairns of the Scotia Private Client Group. Welcome, John. Thank you, Michelle. We uh, went to the uh, streets this week to find out what the pressing financial question was, and here's what we found. Do I really need a will? Well, my kids get along. They know what, what I want. Does he really need a will? Yes. Everyone, <laughs> everyone should have a will. Uh, and there's a couple of very basic reasons for that. It does detail what you want to happen to your assets. Uh, so regardless of whether you talk to your kids or how you talk to them, there's always some disagreement well, about you know, personal things and how that gets distributed. So you can deal with those things. There's obviously the bigger issues as far as uh, money, RSPs, that kind of thing. So the, it does detail what you truly want to happen with your assets. And the other part is it does designate who your executor is. So you can have a person as an executor, or you can have a corporate entity, such as a trust company. And you will need an executor uh, to deal with a bank account, or to sell your house, or to sell your car. Those, those big items, you need an executor to deal with those. And if you die without a will, it's called dying intestate, and meaning that you have to have somebody assigned as the administrator for your estate. And in that scenario, your assets get distributed according to the laws of the province that you reside in, and that might not be how you want them to be distributed. So you can run the risk of leaving, uh, first of all, not realizing your own wishes in the situation and, and leaving a great big mess for family and friends. Yeah. If you do a will properly, it's much more efficient and gets done in a timely manner. So you, build, you spend your whole life building your assets, and this is just basically the last piece of paper to make sure it transfers correctly to the next generation. Uh, graciously, instead of uh, people cursing you at the exactly. end of the day. Exactly, yes. That's really good advice. John Cairns, thank you. Thank you. Thanks so much for joining us for the show. We're going to leave you now with the quote of the week.